Hello, in this video, I will talk about how to define a function in Maple. So to do this, I need to be in math mode because I'm going to ask Maple to do something mathematical. So I'm going to click on math mode up here at the top of my screen. Notice that the cursor is now slanted. To set up a function in Maple, and this is an executable function like f of x, I'm going to go over to the expression palette, click on the notation for defining a function. I'm going to call this function f. My independent variable is going to be x, and the function will be sine x. Let's make sure that Maple understood what we are asking. Let's compute f of pi over 2. Pi is found down in the common symbols palette. And Maple gives me the answer 1. I can also plot the function by typing in plot f of x. And suppose I want to plot this function as x goes from negative 10 up to 10. Next, let's define a piecewise function. I will go back to the expression palette, click on the notation for defining a function, and this function I'm going to call g. I will still use x for my independent variable. And now I'm going to define a piecewise function. The piecewise function that I will define says that when x is less than 3, I'll use the function sine of x. And when x is greater than or equal to 3, I'll use the function x squared. We can see that Maple did understand that I'm defining a piecewise function. Let's plot the piecewise function. And we'll do that as x goes from negative 10 up to 10. Now this looks quite strange. To improve this graph, we could reduce the domain from negative 10 to 5. That looks a bit better, but we still notice something very strange here, and that Maple has tried to connect the endpoint of the sine curve to the start of this parabola. We don't want to do that. We know that this is a discontinuous graph. And to plot this properly, we have to set discontin equal to true. In other words, we're telling Maple that this is indeed a discontinuous graph. Now we have a much better looking plot of our piecewise function. <laughs> 